And this was a storm chase in which I started in southeastern Oklahoma, but quickly realized that not only had I missed the target, but the fact that I was surrounded by trees and hills, I was not in a good area. I turned back west, and I was pleasantly surprised to see that winds were backing ahead of a dry line, and supercells along the dry line were becoming rapidly intense. So I got into a position, caught up with a storm near the Oklahoma-Texas border along the Red River, and I'm actually here in Texas watching a tornado form over the border in Oklahoma. It was my first tornado officially of the spring season, not including some preseason storms in February and March, but I was able to kind of watch in this field. A tornado that not many chasers were on, and I do understand there were some more photogenic and more intense tornadoes to the north, but I had this one all to myself, and after the first few hours of the chase were a disaster, it was just great to see anything, let alone let alone this tornado. So that made it made it a pretty good chase, very worthwhile. And as I headed back north after the storm had passed, there was a spectacular sunset on top of it. So that kind of made it all around a great storm chase. One of my actually favorite panoramic photos of the year. And this storm chase finishes the list at number nine of my top 10 storm chases of 2016.